All right, guys, welcome to episode 69 of Dope Talk TV. It's yours truly, Low Key. Got John here with me. Got Jay over there. Got Sheesh. Remy and Aubrey in the Woo. back. We're back with another one, man. We yes, appreciate sir. everybody that's rocking, liking, sharing, subscribing, all that good shit. Don't forget, thumbs up, like this video if you're fucking with it. Go down in the description, cop yourself some merch if you're fucking with us. And uh, yeah, man, how y'all feeling today, boys? I'm feeling good. We feeling all right, man. You know, we had a rough start. We went to the store and we had a couple assholes try to be assholes, but you know what? Straight to it. <laughs> but you know what? <laughs> this thing is good. hurt. We're feeling good. Positive vibes. Positivity. I don't, even, I don't even feel that frequency anymore, bro. We didn't even wear our masks in the store. <laughs> so maybe that triggered him a little bit. Yep. But hey, buddy, if you're watching this out there, John's pissed. I'm really pissed. And nah, I'm, he's feeling a type of way. Like, if if you out there watching, bro, like, DM us. You know, we can set something up. Yeah, yeah we, we can set something ones. up. We'll, throw, you know what I'm saying? John's going to eat your ass. I'm going to eat your ass, and I'm going to throw you in the fucking grass, you fucking piece of shit. Uh, that was that was straight to it, man. I, I like know. it. I like it. I, I like, like how we rocking it. But we're we're up what episode fucking sixty nine. God damn it, you 69, get it. Congratulations, that's boys. A, that's that's a that's a milestone. You know what I'm saying? Congratulations. That's it a is. fucking milestone. It is. Fuck, man. Sixty nine, bro. You know, that's a lot of good things about. That's 69. his favorite rapper. That's his favorite rapper. Six nine. I like six nine. Legend. <laughs> Legend. Legend. I like the 69 like yeah, exactly. all that good shit all that good shit up man let me get that lighter man let me get that motherfucking light but yeah I ain't even gonna lie guys today we ain't come with much man we're fucking chilling we're cooling I'm off of edible so I'm fucking soaring like an eagle you know what I mean <gasps> and we're just chilling man we you know I've been fucking slacking with, with certain shit you know Johnny Boy and, t and I had a conversation today and he was right, man. I gotta, I gotta get back on my shit with, with this music shit and just everything in general. You know what I'm saying? It was the end of the year. I got a little too comfortable. I think that happens to a lot of people. You know, like the end of the year yeah. comes, you, you, you know, you take that break, you get a little comfortable, and then you don't want to come back from the break. You know? Yeah. And uh, yeah, man, you, you got to stay productive. So I appreciate you, bro. You know what hey, I'm saying? Man, For man. you got to keep it real, bro. When I fuck up, you, you tell me. Yeah, bro, that's how, that's how it is, bro. You that's guys should give each other a kiss. I tell you what, look, 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 Nah, yeah, we should get that. And a bomb. <laughs> Facts. Fire. Mm -hmm. Fire in the booth. Charlie Sloth. Charlie. Charlie. Nah, but you know what? I had something I wanted to talk about. I had a real question, too. Like what, up? what up? What up? What up? What up? We're here. We're nah, here. Nah, man. Listen. So, you know, back in the day, back in the 40s, you know, back in the 30s, you know, the proper times, you know, the mafia mm -hmm. times, you know, we weren't fucking suits and all these fucking shits. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. We weren't yeah. that. Yes. But you were proper. It doesn't matter where you went. You went to fucking to the grocery store. You're wearing a yeah, suit. Yeah, facts. You're going to the fucking. The jacket and tie, motherfucker. You're going to the when gym in a suit and then you're changing out of it. And then when you leave the gym, you know what I'm saying? You're going to wear a fucking suit. That's how it is. But I want to know who was the one motherfucker that decided to say, fuck this. I ain't wearing a fucking suit. Deadass, the one about. motherfucker that came out with some jeans and a fucking t-shirt on some bum shit. For real. said, fuck it. Yeah. This like, is who, it. Who was the first motherfucker to say, yo, fuck it? Because now, like... I mean, I kind of feel him, though. Yeah, Because I'm trying to be comfortable. <laughs> fuck y'all niggas. It's 110 <laughs> degrees out, and y'all fucking suited up. Anyway, it doesn't matter which state. We're going to the up. beach, and you got a suit on, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> nah, fuck out of here, bitch. I'm fucking... <laughs> I don't get that shit, bro. I, I yo, in the 1960s, the bro. Men's, it says that men stopped wearing hats and suits around April 12, 1960. Hats what? disappeared for most what of the, the First of all, why the fuck is this so specifically down to the date? That's what I said. Yeah, April 12, 1960. <laughs> I was there. All of them put the fucking they fedoras say, away. They say they JFK killed, it, killed that trend. JFK. JFK. Yo, salute to JFK. He was a G. JFK he said, was a G. hey, hey, fam. What? No more hats. And they say, yo, fam, I'll tell you what, bro. 
I'm fucking tired of these motherfuckers too, bro. I'm tired. I'm tired of fucking. <laughs> Get it off your chest. Nah, Get it all off come your on, chest. Come on, Johnny. We're here to listen. We're here to listen. We're here to fucking vent. Yo, bro, I try to help a motherfucker out, and motherfuckers just want to be like, "Nah, man, I can do it." You know, like I feel like that's not a good trait to have as a person. I think that's very hard headed. Yeah. Like, bro, because that's not gonna get you anywhere. You know what I mean? Like, it's just really not going to get you anywhere. Like, yeah, like, it's good to get it by yourself. But at the end of the day, I feel like everybody needs help in certain, like, certain ways. You know no, what I mean? of course. Like, am of I course. right? Self-made is not real. Yeah, there. there's no such thing as self-made, yeah. man. There's always a team. There's a always facade. a team that has to be involved, bro. Like, Some people just take all the credit because they're pussies. And they don't give credit to their team when they get out there. But you hear those announcements when people get on stage, sometimes they're long and they get the music put on them. Like, get the fuck off stage. But they got a lot of people they're going to thank, bro. Yeah, you right. know what I'm saying? Because when you really think about, oh, you got to thank your managers. Because when you're when you're an actor, bro, you're acting. You ain't got time to call a- agents and managers and sponsors and whatever the fuck. That's why you need your team. Exactly. So without that team getting you movie scripts, your agent getting you roles in movies, you ain't shit. You're just an actor trying to find work. A rapper nice. trying to be a rapper. If you don't have a manager and an agency that's trying to really ha- help you, even Russ, I'm sure he did a lot of stuff by himself, but there was people that helped him along the way, whether it was with ideas, whether it was with a loan, money, a connection, a phone yeah, number. Yeah, or just the, yeah. the fucking uh, knowledge about how to go to, about like the business transaction or some yeah, shit. Bro. Like You always need somebody, a lawyer, whatever. You need a team. Mm-hmm. You need a team. Like You can't do it all by yourself, bro. You know, as much as you'd like to, like you really can't. Get your fucking life in order. Get your fucking J. Cole in this bitch. J. Nah, Cole. Nah, J. Cole. J. Cole. He's a biracial yeah, angel. <laughs> Is he really biracial? I don't know. I just do that out there. <laughs> I said fuck the facts. Nah, fuck it. Kevin Gates is Puerto Rican. People don't know that. Yeah, he's Puerto Rican. Nah, that. we don't want him. Yeah, yeah. We don't want him. We're trading him. Yeah. The blacks can who, have him. Who we, who we, we trading him for? We want, um, we want Travis Scott. Yeah, no. Nah. We want Travis Scott, okay? Yeah, facts. <laughs> Please. Tra- Travis fucking Scott. I know Travis a lot of Scott people is hate a fucking him, but goat, bro. he's a goat, bro. He's a genius. Give that, it. Like, people don't give credit when it's due. Yeah. That's the problem. Like, fuck the Travis. Like, look at Tom Brady, bro. Like, we got to talk yeah. about that. Oh, yo, oh, Tom Brady. Get God. that, man. Like, his fucking bro. credit, bro. This like, nigga got his team bro. back. Not even LeBron can do that. Fuck you, LeBron. You piece of shit. That shit's crazy, bro. First of all, I don't even think... Have we been to the Super Bowl? Has Tampa ever been to the I, Super Bowl? I think bro, they have, Orlando but it's been so... Orlando's been to the Super Bowl like three times. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. Nah, that's bullshit. We don't have one. That's fucking lying. Orlando, I'm this thing is... <laughs> I'm just playing. I'm just playing. I don't watch like, soccer. You talking about the Solar Bears? What they is go, that? What? The Solar Bears, the hockey team. That's a real thing? Yeah. That's a team here? A yeah, solar man. bear? Justin took me to the fucking game. Holy shit, the solar bear. Yeah, we have a hockey team. Yo, first of all, I know. Hey, no, shout out to the solar bears, but even y'all know that they tried y'all with that name. What the fuck? Oh, snap. It's, it's a, a real solar thing. Bear. Wow. Solar bears. Why? Because they couldn't use polar bears? Nah, but it was legit, man. Shout out to Justin because he took me to my first hockey game. They fought, too. There was people fighting. Oh, yeah, yeah. They'll fuck each other up on that ice. You know what I mean? And he brought me to the to the box. Fuck hockey. To the fucking box where they serve, like, alcohol and shit. Like, <laughs> I went to my I'm first hockey lie, game. Man. It was a Buffalo hockey, Sabres. Hockey is one of those sports. To me, it's like... You gotta be white I'll, to like yeah, it. Yeah, I'll watch it if I'm, like, kind of tipsy or something. If, I, if it's, like... In the room being played or some shit, but I'm not gonna put it on. Like, Bro, myself, you know? I went to a Buffalo like, Sabres like game and I was too. done by first quarter. I was out like I was there and everybody's chilling. I'm like, well, with a group of white friends, and I was like, I'm out, guys. I was like, I can't do it. They're like, it's Bro, only the Bro, second facts. quarter. I barely made it past the first quarter. I'm definitely nah, not gonna facts. put myself through the second. Nah, quarter. it's like That's NASCAR, so bro. Like, <laughs> my boy fucking Toby. Shout out Toby. This <laughs> nigga <laughs> fucking loves NASCAR. And it's like, bro, I can't, I can't fucking watch that shit. Bro, he took me to the NASCAR shit, right? He got me a free ticket, so I went in there, right? <laughs> a and free it ticket. To rain. It That's how shitty it is. I, no, you can't like, get a free ticket yo, to the fucking nah, NFL. Nah, listen. So went, <laughs> nah, bro, wait, listen, though. I went to the fucking, I went to this fucking place, right? And it started to fucking rain. It started to <laughs> fucking rain, and I fucking, not even 10 minutes. Then they delayed it. And I waited. I was fucking bored. And then they canceled it. And then I was just like, Jesus. He's like, you can go back. Don't go back. I was like, I'm 
coming back. Bro. I ain't bro. coming back. Bro. Michael Rain check. Rain check. Rain check. Nah, that's yeah. ass. Shout out to De- Jeff Gordon, R.I.P. Yeah, nah, for, for real. Was it Jeff Gordon that died? It was nah, Jeff I'm just Gordon. kidding. He didn't die. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to you, Jeff Gordon. Stay alive, my friend. <laughs> Jeff Gordon, it was fucking, um, I don't know. Dale Earnhardt, bro. Dale, yep, Dale Earnhardt. Damn, Damn. 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 Green White enough. Green White guess, enough. Well, guess what? Guess what? Fucking what? Toby's parents went to that fucking race and saw it happen. No. Oh, really? my God. Yes. Did they got photos? And they cried. I bet they cried, bro. That's like, crazy. I remember when that shit was all over the that's, TV. That's and everything. like you rooting for your favorite fucking driver, and he or that's like Tom or, Brady dying. Yeah, on the football field. It's like Kobe Bryant, but he's already dead. <laughs> so I'm sorry. You know I mean? I, I, that's I, what I'm I, saying, though. No, that's no, what, no I don't he's know. He's like Kobe Bryant. Like he, you know what I mean, he's a legend. But shout out to Kobe Bryant, RIP. <laughs> 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 Just watch your fucking body. Hey, hey. Nah, nah watch nah, your nah, Hey, all watch your fucking body. Nah, watch. Hey, hey bro, watch shit. your mouth. I'm at the floor. You lost me. You lost me. I'm all like, where's he going with this story? <laughs> he's like, I was following it, and then he's know, like, it's hey, Kobe Bryant. And I'm like, I don't know. I'm not getting the connection. Hey, hey, but anyways, back to fucking Tom Brady. What I was saying oh, about legend, Tom Brady. Legend. Legend, bro. Legend, nah, nah, right? facts. Salute yeah. Tom Brady, yeah, bro. For real. But people, <laughs> wanna, shape, people are talking shit about Tom Brady, bro. They were like, oh, it was because of Belichick. It was because of the fucking, you know, it was because of this and that and this. Bro, it was Tom Brady. They're like, nah, watch. He's gonna yeah, go to, bro. He's going to go to Tampa and he's going to fucking be shitty. Well, guess what? This motherfucker just did it. And y'all don't even want to give him the credit when it's due still. It's like, bro, like, <coughs> I don't fucking get it. Nah, he, he's literally... <laughs> the greatest yeah, quarterback is. of all time. No, but you know, people have been talking shit about him since before, like college days. I watched like <laughs> a documentary about Tom Brady, and it talks about that, like, and it shows old videos of him, like the ones that scouts look at and shit mm-hmm. when you're in college. And people were like, everything about him said, like, no, worst choice. Like, he was not yeah. even the first round draft pick. You know, he was way fucking later. So the thing is, everyone he worked at that shit. Bro. Yeah, everyone was talking shit like he doesn't have form. He doesn't. He doesn't have this. He doesn't have that. Look, at his, he's not even like in shape. No, he's not. You know what I'm saying? They're like he's slow. He's not quick. But no matter. And these were professionals, analysts that studied the game for years, <laughs> talked about the game. But look at what he's accomplished. Accolades are everything, bro. What you got under your belt? Okay, if you say that you're. The baddest fucking dude around, you better have at least fucking five fights, at least five fights, and one, all five of them. And you're like, you know, you gotta, you can't just walk around saying certain things. Like, look at Conor McGregor. Yeah, man, that was crazy. Nigga, one night night. Hey, bro, sometimes, sometimes you fucking get overconfident, and that could fuck you up. You get comfortable, bro, with having money. Yeah, facts. He's been rich for a he long under, time. He underestimated the guy because he already beat him, yeah. and that's something you never do. Yeah. You got to walk into that fight like you never fought this That guy was before. hungry. Like, you got to fight. Like, yeah, bro, like, you got to walk in there, like, with the same hunger you walked in there with before. And Tom Brady, bro, the, his demeanor, though, has never been, like, a shit-talking demeanor. Very calm, very quiet. And people think about this. We were just talking about somebody talking shit to you, right, John? And we were talking about that incident that happened. Think about Tom Brady. How many people have talked shit? And he's had a public platform where he could be like, yo, fuck you, fuck you. But he doesn't. You no, know what he, he does? The his, accolades, Yeah, bro. he lets his fucking work speak Yeah, him, exactly. Really. And look at he's here with the Super Bowl, motherfucker. That's fucking the insane. Fucking I'm going to watch it. I'm going to watch it. I don't watch football anymore like nah, that. Nah, I ain't going to lie. You got like, political. Fuck you. I watch the Super you. Bowl. You know, I watch like, shit like that. Yeah. I watch the fight. You know, the No, the, but the I'm NBA here in Florida, bro. Shit. And this is a, like a big deal down here. So I no, definitely yeah, got to yeah, tune yeah. into that. We're going to get so fucked nah. Bro, let's go to Tampa. It's going to be lit let's down go there. Go to Tampa. Yo, let's just fuck go. it. Why not, man? Let's get an Airbnb. If anybody oh, wants to go to Tampa, say it in the comments. Let's go. For the Super Bowl. We're going to start. for everybody. We're going to start a GoFundMe so Jay can pay for everybody. Pay for everyone. No, I'm saying I pay for everybody to watch it. <laughs> <laughs> to watch it. Man, you owe a lot of money then, goddamn. You gonna be broke. Damn. No, no, no I'm gonna stream it on on our YouTube through this camera that you're looking at me. <laughs> I'm gonna stream it live for those of you that got at least Wi-Fi. Nah, facts. That's crazy. Fuck the system. 
fuck the system. Yo, fuck the system for real. It's crazy how, like, it doesn't matter what fucking piece of shit you put in the office. It's just They're all pieces of it's shit. It's the same shit, different toilet. You know what I mean, Mav? I watched a documentary about the presidents of the United States the other day, and I encourage everybody to go do the same. You're going to see one thing. It's a pattern of fucking bullshit. Guess what? Ronald Reagan was going around saying we're going to make America great again. Go back. Go back and watch it for your fucking selves. And it's yeah, the same for shit real, as for being, real? Yeah, yeah, for real. Yeah. And I was like, I told, I told my what wife, I'm fuck? like, yo, that's the same shit this nigga was just saying. All the place. Like, what the fuck? I'm like, this is a, and I told her, I was like, you know what's going on here? This is the same play year after year after year. Every president has the same speech. Oh, we're going to do this every year. And the poor fucking pathetic people believe it. And, and I, as soon this as year, I was one of those. This last want. year, I was one of those people. I was like, yo, damn, I am going to vote. Boom. All of a sudden, the scandal shit erupted. I'm like, yo, fuck all this shit. <laughs> I was like, I want nothing to do with voting. I'm never voting Fact. again in my fucking life. Nah, fuck facts. you to the system. And I'm just not even going to mention it. Fuck the system and fuck Robin Hood. That took all my fucking money. Yo, Robin Hood too. <laughs> hey. Yo, nah, nah. Hey, yo. Y'all Robin niggas, yo. Yo, yo they hey, Robin, Robin Hood. Hood. <laughs> Robin Hood robbed the hood. No, nah, fuck out of here. They me, bro. And listen. Uh, beat the fuck yo, out of here, Robin. You didn't, <laughs> you didn't see the interview? Bro, the CEO is like a regular kid like us, bro. And he's sitting there on a oh, camera. Yeah? On the interview, and he's like, a the, the newscaster is like, so why are I'm you? I'm a grown man. You, so you're telling me that people downloaded this app, bro, because I downloaded this app because we're supposed to make fucking profit off this. You're not letting anybody sell their stocks. Why is that? And this motherfucker had a long ass excuse, and all I saw was cap and her cap. Cap. <laughs> like, yo, that ass, he bro. all about the cap new era. Like, I heard cap all day, bro, and I was just like, man, this guy is making millions. He's making... Was he white? Was he white? Yeah, he's a white guy. Guess what? Guess what? He's going to get away with it. Yeah, nah, facts. Probation. Probation. <laughs> house arrest. Nah, bro. He's getting a law from House arrest stuff, where man. he could manage his company. John, John doesn't know what that's like because he's like a biracial, uh, you know, no, golden child. But imagine... <laughs> so he can blend I'm in as a child. white man. No, and I appreciate that no, about him. I'm pissed that's because, why we're friends. No, no, no. I'm pissed. I, I mean, I'm not really too pissed. <laughs> about it because i didn't really lose money and for some reason i told hector i had a conversation we were at the gym and we were like yo like man i really just i feel like i should just take all my money out yo, they, I mean? they, they, they almost I, got your ass and, too. They, and i took all my money out i made 500 bucks so what? i didn't lose anything you made something i didn't lose shit i bought 20 shares of apple i had it for about maybe the five best place months. to invest your money is under your mattress invest nah, it in facts. there Yo, I'm not gonna lie. My grandpa, my grandpa taught me that. He's like, bro, you don't keep most of your money in the bank, cause when that shit goes bust, you can't get a motherfucking dollar out of that shit. Yo, that's a fact. Everybody's gonna be running for the hills. People's not even gonna care about money. They're gonna be fucking sucking dick for fucking hamburgers. <laughs> Niggas are gonna be <laughs> trading, sandwiches. trading fucking like Low blankets for... for for chicken and shit. Like, <laughs> or <trail>. trading. <laughs> nah, nah, man. I'm now what, let's talk about that for what would happen what do you guys think would happen if like hey, money just stop completely working. goes away what would be the currency like what would happen ass ass i ass mean ass has been a ass was the first currency universal baby besides ass though like what do you think what do you think would be you know something that oh i know um death uh, I feel like okay, everyone's dying around me. Uh, Every single person that's around me is dying, nah, facts, including like, my own family. I I like, they're just dead weight at that point. I feel like mechanics would make it far. Mechanics, yeah, electricians, you trades, know what I'm saying? Trades, trades men, period. Tradesmen. Yeah, trades. Well, prostitutes, keep the world fucking go. Yo, oh no, prostitutes for sure. Women that they're gonna be doing drug the drug dealers. Women that you know. <laughs> You know are gonna be are the gonna most vulnerable run. though. Let's women, single women are gonna be the most vulnerable. Single yeah, women with no men. Yeah, oh, nah, facts. Yeah, people are gonna know. Yeah, people. Yeah. Yo, I watched that story. That's you want to talk about a story? Look at that lady that. Mama, <laughs> mama. <laughs> Look at the story of that lady okay. that they, she found out. Both of my moms are single. Both of my moms. Yeah, facts. Someone come save them. Your mom single? Oh, my mom. Yeah. Oh yeah. My All mom. of our moms, moms are single. single. <laughs> Hit us up. Yo, my mom's been single for six years, bro. <laughs> my mom's been single for six years, bro. Yeah. Well, yo, you got to tell your mom and stuff to watch out because some lady, they, it was like snowing and somebody wrote like an A1 or something there, a one if a something on her garbage and she posted it to her like her Twitter feed or something. She has a ton of followers and some people were it's like, yo, that's some gang shit. It says like one single female lives in this house. That's what it's letting like for tra sex trafficking. And I'm just like, damn, that means that somebody was targeting her. Bro, Get a gun. 
A predator is a predator. But you know what? They're talking gun. about guns. Look at all this bullshit, all these bills being introduced to try to control guns. Ironically, this motherfucker gets in office and all of these shootings are happening everywhere. Hey, because bro. they need to brainwash people to get people on board. Because how did Hitler get people convinced? You tell me how Hitler got millions and millions of people to be on board with killing millions of people. You see what I'm saying? If How are you going to get people to be angry against guns? Let's do more mass shootings everywhere on yeah. the news. Mass shootings scare nah, people. But I don't, think, that, I don't think that's been working. Nah. Have you guys seen, like, I haven't heard of it. I mean, maybe they're still going on or mm. whatever, but they I haven't It just introduced one in Florida, a bill to, to go against assault rifles. But it's Man, not going to pass. If you go and Ultimately, read it, bro, all my guns are legal. You know what I'm saying? Thank God they're all under my name. You're like, you're going to have to kill me to take They're em. all under my name, you know, so I, I'm good. But, <clears throat> hey, man, I'd rather be judged by 12 than carried by 6. Any Bro, fucking day. But at the end of the day, this Any is it. Fucking day. They do the buyback program that this motherfucker's talking about, mandatory buyback. Well, you'll have to go like they did in Australia and sell your guns to the government and they'll give you a check for them. Like, at the end, you're only fucking the law-abiding citizens. Because bad people that are doing fucked up shit are going to get them no matter what. Even when they're off the street, they're still going to be a black market. Those people are still going to get them. Bro, so you there's and like, I are fucked. There's like 3D printers where niggas could fucking literally print their own guns now. Like make their own So what do guns. they get by taking all the guns away from the citizens and disarming the That's citizens? True. What was the Second Amendment created for? To protect you against what? A tyrannical government. That's exactly. what it says. Facts. So why would you want to disarm us Even all? the founding fathers knew what this shit was going to end up doing. Oh. They were like, yo, if the government gets too crazy, y'all keep, keep y'all guns. <laughs> Corona. Corona. Oh, now you said that word. They're going to flag your video. I don't want to breathe around this nigga now. Moving. <laughs> nah, bro. Yo. If you guys ever. My dog today, drinking lean. He drinking lean. No, I'm just kidding. I'm it's drinking antifreeze. piss. It's antifreeze. <laughs> From my Toyota. <laughs> Yo, it's antifreeze. I'm bro. just kidding. Holy Disclaimer. This is not antifreeze. Yeah. <laughs> it's lean. I'm just kidding. It's not lean either. Fuck that. We don't do that. Fucking lean. It's just Mountain Dew. Nah, we got to talk about something, man. I just did a special thing. Well, we, well, we Comment down about. below if you want to see how I made this Mountain Dew this color. <laughs> okay? Let me know. I want to talk about something. It glows in the dark. Quick. Pull it out. I like, want to say I love every single one of y'all, whoever's fucking watching these videos and shit, real talk. Nah, facts, man. Why you always gotta go there, bro? Because I get sent to... I don't know, man. I you are a real sentimental. You need yeah. to check your hormone level, bro. <laughs> Yo, Something's man. wrong. He said you's a straight bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I said sentimental. Hector said you. The next episode, bro. The next episode, bro. I'm gonna sound like dude. Because I'm gonna get a shot. The next episode we want you to do with no yeah. shirt on. I bet you won't. So tell me how 50 Cent was fucking getting injected with steroids the whole time. What? Who thought yeah. that that was natural? Tell me. When he was like really fucking big. Back in the his only great album. Get when Richard he didn't crying. ever work out. Like, you never fuck. I mean, I guess I it's like different because it's really like built. it was in the social <laughs> media era. Yeah. You know, so like you didn't you didn't see niggas like that or what they did, but I don't think Fifty fucking worked out. He just fucking took steroids and did a couple push ups and sit ups, nigga, and that's it. Nah, for real. There's a couple friends that I know that are just built like that. Big. He was just nah, facts. Thanks. But yeah, oh guys, we've been back with another one. We appreciate everybody that's rocking, liking, sharing, subscribing. Don't forget to do just that. Thumbs up, like the video, go down in the description and go get yourself some merch. And uh, yeah, guys, don't forget, tell each other you love each He's other. High. He's <laughs> high. High He's high. Don't forget. <laughs> don't forget. Jeez. I'm high as fuck. Peace, Peace. and love. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs>